In this video, we're going to solve the following problem. If f at x is equals x squared minus 6x plus 16, and g at x equals negative x squared minus 20x minus k, determine the value of k so that there is exactly one point of intersection between the two parabolas. So in order to solve the point of intersection, we can set these equal to each other because that's the point where they will uh, intersect. We set them equal to each other and we're going to simplify. We're going to have everything on one side with a zero on the opposite side. So we, we rearrange it, making sure we do opposite operations, and then we simplify it. So this is what we're left with when we're simplifying. 2x squared plus 14 plus 14 plus k. So in order to find one point of intersection, we knew that the discriminant b squared minus 4ac should equal to 0. Right? So we're going to use that information to solve. So we know that a in this case is 2, b is 14, okay? and c is both of these. So 14 plus k, whatever k is, just the number. So we're going to subset in b squared minus 4ac, so 14 is b, 2 is a, and 14 plus k is c. Simplify, 14 squared, 196, 4 times 2 is 18, I mean sorry, 4 times 2 is 8, right there. Okay, and then we're, so that's a little bit of a duplicate there. So now we simplify it again. 8 times 14 is 112. Negative 8 times k is negative 8k. 196 minus 112 equals 8k. So I just put the k on this side so that we can isolate k because that's what we're trying to solve. So numbers on one side, variables on the other. And then we end up 196 minus 112, which is 84, which is equal to 8k. Divide 84 by 8, so we get 10.5. And that's our k value. So for one point of intersection between the given functions, the k value should be 10.5. I hope this uh, answers your questions for more solutions please subscribe to my channel I will leave this on for a little bit just so that if you need to take it down uh, or absorb it some more you have a visual of it all together